Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Combo here, bringing you guys some Modern Warfare Reflex free for all. It's actually one of my first free for all gameplays in such a long time. I can't remember the last time I uploaded a free for all. I used to play it a lot back in Reflex and in World at War. It was a lot of fun to play those, um, but for some reason, I got I kind of uh, you know grew away from them in Black Ops and Modern Warfare 3. They're they're not quite the same in those games for some reason. I think free for all here was purely gun on gun battle, which is how it should be. I think free for all in Black Ops and in Modern Warfare Re uh, Modern Warfare 3 was a bit too complex and complicated with all the kill streaks and everything going on. So I just like it, you know, simple how it is in here, where it's just the three airstrike, you know, the airstrike, the UAV, and the and the helicopter. They're not too dominating. So like I said, I mean, it all comes down to who is the best player with their with their gun. So. I mean, that's just how I was. So I hope you guys do enjoy the gameplay. So what I actually wanted to talk about uh, in this commentary is the E3 Expo upcoming Wii U kind of stuff and possible games including Black Ops 2 and all that kind of stuff. Um, if you guys don't know the E3 um, Expo, I guess you can say, it's kind of like, uh, I, always, I always make fun of it on TV when it says like MLB Baseball, it's like Major League Baseball Baseball, but I just called uh, E3 Expo, it's, it stands for Electronics Entertainment Expo, so by calling it E3 Expo, it's just, you know, repeating, you guys get it, I, I should stop talking, but um, basically what it is, is where a bunch of gaming companies, you know, the main guys of the gaming companies, including like Ubisoft, um, Activision, all these big game companies, as well as, you know, people who make consoles like Nintendo, those kinds of companies, they get together and they announce what their, you know, what projects are in the work. Uh, last year, Nintendo, as you guys know, uh, released information on the Wii U, which is the new console that's going to be coming out later this year in 2012. Um, they released the prototype version. They kind of showed what it will be doing and kind of uh, gave us a little sneak peek about it. Now, there's been like a lot of speculation over the last year, and pretty much what we're going to be expecting to see is the full, you know, ready-to-go type Wii U console, ready-to-go um, at at E3 and pretty much I have the schedule here if you guys want to check it out it'll be in the description but pretty much Nintendo is set to go on on a few days here we have um, we have Nintendo is ready to go here on Tuesday June 5th at 9 a.m. I believe they're gonna be doing a live stream or something like that and they'll be like I said just reviewing uh, a few things including the Wii U probably is the it's definitely the thing most people are looking forward to um, and then they have the uh, Nintendo Evening Conference, which starts at 6 p.m. Uh, Pacific Time. These are all Pacific Time. So, um, you know, and then the next day on Wednesday, June 6th, they'll have Evening Conference number two at 6 p.m. So, I mean, they're going they're going to have a lot of time here to kind of announce and show what they're gonna what they want to show about the Wii U. I'm sure there will be a lot of footage about it. So, if you guys uh, are excited about the Wii U, I definitely suggest tuning into the uh, to the E3 you know live stream or whatever. I, I'll probably give you guys the rundown about the Wii U on my channel um, when it happens. I think I'm gonna be in school, uh, you know, the first initial live stream of of Nintendo. So. Um, but either way, I'm going to try to get you guys all the Wii U news, all the Black Ops 2 news if they release any, uh, which I actually think they will be releasing uh, because they pretty much give a sneak peek of the next Call of Duty at every E3 convention. Um, and even if it's, you know, just a little bit of campaign or whatever, um, but pretty much it's going to show a lot of stuff that we are excited to see. I mean, I definitely think Black Ops 2 will be coming out on the Wii U. Um, and this kind of hints towards it. I actually uh, got a message here from uh, one of my longtime friends, Rusty Doggy, who actually uh, sent me this article. So thanks to him, uh, his link will be in the description to, to his channel. Uh, but basically what this article goes over is a bunch of Wii U stuff. Um, but in the ninth paragraph, it actually reads, The Wii U was announced last year, and that's stimulates all kinds of thoughts and what's possible, said Mark Lamia, the studio head at Call of Duty Black Ops 2 uh, developer Treyarch. It'll be interesting to see what happens with the first parties. It's always an exciting time when rumors are in the air and we see if E3 is the time that is the time when they become more than rumors. So, I mean, if he's going to comment about the Wii U, I'm pretty sure they're going to announce some Wii U slash Black Ops 2 connection, some possible gameplay. I don't know, guys. I thought it'd be. I think it'd be pretty cool to release some Black Ops 2 gameplay. Um, how about how about we have some uh, Wii U footage for once? You know, we're always used to seeing the you know the Xbox, the PS3 trailers and all that kind of stuff. But how about a Wii U trailer? I thought that'd be pretty cool to to release. Um, but you know, like I said. 
this is uh, pretty much when we get all our news right here. So I'm looking forward to the to June 6th uh, and si and uh, 5th to you know see about the Wii U and all that kind of stuff. And hopefully it'll be a, a pretty good console. I, I have I have hope, and I hopefully um, it will it will uh, you know be really good. And hopefully we'll get some uh, good Call of Duty titles to go along with it. But there will be a lot of more games other than Call of Duty that will be released that weren't initially released on the Wii. Um, so it'll be interest. It's just going to be a very interesting time to see um, what they're going to do and all that kind of stuff. And uh, I'm pretty excited, guys. So. Like I said, all the links will be in the description to the articles, to the people who sent me the channels, and uh, thank you guys for watching. If you could, please leave a, write, a like, rating, or a dislike, whatever you guys think it deserves, and uh, leave your comment, guys. Are you going to buy the Wii U as soon as it comes out, or are you going to wait you know, a few months till the price drops? Um, right now, I think it's going to be released at $300, which you, is pretty uh, save. You can save up for that um, pretty easily. Um, over time, I guess, but that's pretty much it, guys. I'll see you later. Have a good day.